My name is Zihu Nikitam. I am studying in Brilliant Model School, 9th class. Today we are going to discussing about challenges in improving agriculture production. Food is an important aspect of the substance and survival of human beings as well as other living organisms. Food is very essential to all human beings. Today, the needs of increasing population are constantly growing. There are some effective ways to increase production. Increasing the area of cultivated land, increasing production in the existing land, developing high yielding varieties, alternating crops, mixed crops, cultivating short term irrigation. Irrigation is the process of applying controlled amounts of water to plants at metered intervals. Irrigation helps to grow agricultural crops, maintain landscapes and revested disturbed soils in dry areas and during periods of less than average rainfall. Plant nutrients. Plant nutrients are the chemical elements that are essential to the nutrition of plant health. Plant nutrients fall into three categories, all of which are based on the amount a plant needs, not the importance of the individual amount. Each plant nutrients performs a crucial role in plant growth and development. Macronutrients The plants require in larger quantities. For example, plants need nitrogen, phosphorus, and potassium salts in larger quantities. These are called macronutrients. Micronutrients. Some nutrients are necessary for plants in smaller quantities. These are called micronutrients. Example, iron, manganese, brown, zinc, copper, nickel, etc. Soil nutrients. Soil is a major source of nutrients needed by plants for growth. The three main nutrients are nitrogen, phosphorus and potassium. Together they make up the trio known as NPK. Other important nutrients are calcium, magnesium and sulfur. Crop rotation. Crop rotation is the practice of growing a series of dissimilar or different type of crops in the same area in sequential seasons. It is done so that the soil of farms is not used for only set of nutrients, soil fertility and crop yield. Mixed crops. Mixed crops is a type of agriculture that involves planting two or more plants in the same field is called mixed crops. Organic manure. Organic manure is a well decomposed material used in organic agriculture. Chemicals, harmful organisms, and weed seeds, either it is from a animal or plant origin. Green manure. Green manure is a cover crop sown on an agriculture plot in order to fertilize the soil for crop mainly through the intake of nitrogen. Green manure provides improvement in soil structure with a root system and relatively little supply of stable organic matter. Soil testing. Soil testing is used to access what soil nutrients are present or may be needed for plant growth and yield potential. The results from a soil test List the concentration of each measured nutrition. Vermicompost. Vermicompost is a product of the decomposition process using various species of worms, white worms, and other earthworms to create two measure of decomposing vegetables or food waste and vermicompost. Vermicomposting can also be applied for treatment of sewage. Panchagavya. Panchagavya is a term used to describe five major substances obtained from cow, which includes cow's urine, milk, ghee, curd, and dung. All the five products 
process medical properties against many disorders and are used for the medicinal purpose singly or in combination with some other herbs organic form organic form is defined as a production of crop animal and other products without the use of synthetic chemical fertilizers pesticides and chemicals thank you